Hey guys, today I'm making these tiny little toasters for your dolls. If you like this craft, please subscribe. And if you make it, tag me on Instagram and I'll totally come check it out. Uh, and finally kids, do be sure and ask a parent for help before starting this craft. Okay guys, so let's get started. So I just start here with some craft foam paper and I create a shape. Cut it out and then use it as a template to create another shape. Then I cut out four pieces of cardboard, each one slightly smaller than the next, and I'm stacking them with the smallest section being on top, and this is to account for the curve of the toaster. And then I glue my craft foam to my cardboard. and I find that this is a good height for my Pop-Tarts. Then I place my toaster on more craft foam paper, make a mark at the appropriate width. I cut that out and make sure it fits my toaster. And then here just making lines around the middle section. And then using an X-Acto knife, I carefully cut out two sections. And so this is kind of tough, so I found that the easiest way is just to do straight lines for both sections. And then I make a line going the other direction at the tops and bottoms. And eventually you can just kind of pull it out. And I find that the side that I didn't cut usually looks a lot cleaner than the other side. And I'm just using my scissors to clean up any mess. I add another small piece of craft foam paper to the middle just between my two holes and then again on the sides and this is just so that my pop tart won't slide through and now I simply glue my top to my toaster and I just take it in stages because you don't want your hot glue to spill out on the sides and you could probably use super glue too, but I just tried to use the least amount of hot glue that I could get away with so that it wouldn't spill out on the sides. And then you can paint it whatever color you like. And here I'm just using silver nail polish. Then I cut out another piece of craft foam paper for my bottom section and I also paint it with nail polish to give it a nice shine. And also just another little scrap piece for my buttons. And when everything's dry, I cut off a little rectangle, use my multi-hole punch to punch out a tiny little circle of craft foam, and I glue them to the front of my toaster. Then glue my toaster to the bottom piece. pop in my Pop-Tart, which I made in an earlier video, and you are so totally good to go. Well guys, I sure hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, be sure to like, share, and subscribe. Thanks guys!